Hey guys, it's Chantrinas, and today we're going to be trying out the vitamin C method. This method is a pretty long process, so what you'll do is do this over a couple of weeks, uh, maybe a couple of months, and then you'll notice that your hair color has changed significantly. So I'm using the vitamin C to help fade it a little bit. Hopefully it fades enough for me to change into my new hair color. We'll see what happens. And then what you'll do is wet your hair a little bit. Go ahead and smush in that vitamin C mix. Your hair will be really dry after you use this though, so keep that in mind. Make sure you go back in with a really good conditioner after this. And I left it on for, uh, I wanna say, an hour. And it didn't really do that much to my hair, if I'm gonna be honest. But that's kind of what happens with the vitamin C method. It doesn't lift it that much. It actually doesn't lift it at all. It's just helping to fade it a little bit faster. And I ended up doing this two times. This didn't really fade my hair that much, so I had to go back in a couple days later, and I did a bleach bath. I needed to remove the color as fast as possible, so I went in with some new products here. I'm using some 20 volume developer from Ion, as well as their cream lightener. This is also the first time that I've ever used a cream lightener instead of like a powder lightener. Don't use a high level developer for this. Make sure it's like a level five to a level 20. I wouldn't really go as far as a 20 either, honestly, but that's what I'm using today. I'm using a level 20 developer and um, some cream lightening bleach, as well as that Carol's Daughter shampoo. And I mix that all together. I use about twice as much shampoo as I did anything else and um, mix that all in a little bowl. And then um, I dampened my hair a tiny bit and then put in the soap cap mixture onto my hair wherever there's any purple pretty much you'll see that some areas of my hair are green which is kind of normal um, some purple hair dyes do have a greenish undertone when you try to remove it and that's just kind of how hair dye works um, every dye has an undertone and this one, unfortunately, was kind of green. And then this is what it looks like in the end. I know I look crazy, but um, stick around. I will be showing you guys a hair dye video very, very soon. I cannot wait to show you guys. I am obsessed with my new hair color, so I hope you guys like it too. And um, follow me on Instagram if you want to see exactly when I post, because usually on Instagram, I do let you guys know that I have a new video coming out, so make sure you check me out there. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.